What's going on guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be showing you the best professional microphone settings in Adobe Audition. And if you would like to request a tutorial on Adobe Audition, feel free to leave them in the comments or just ask me on my social media. So here we are in Adobe Audition. The first thing I'm going to be doing is simply recording some audio so we can hear how the raw audio will sound before and after. So I'm going to press this button to record and then we'll get into the editing. In this video, I'll be showing you how to improve your microphone quality in Adobe Audition. So you can see, very simple there. And you may notice one thing straight away. I left a gap here, and this gap is where I just stayed quiet. What I'm gonna be doing is playing this gap back, and I also want you to pay attention to the levels down here. Also, if you haven't already, make sure your volume is turned up. So that right there, is the background noise and that is from my laptop fan so you can tell that is very bad now I'll play through the part where I'm talking as well so you can hear the entire thing in this video I'll be showing you how to improve your microphone quality in Adobe Audition so of course that does not sound the best and especially having this background noise in it is terrible so there's a reason I left this gap because we're going to be removing this background noise so believe it or not, it is very simple. For all your future recordings, I do recommend when you record, you leave a gap. This just allows the microphone to pick up the background noise, so then we can remove it. So we're gonna left click and highlight this background noise. We're gonna come up to effect. We're gonna come to noise reduction, and we're gonna select capture noise print. From there, we're gonna press control A on our keyboard. We're gonna come back up to effects. We're gonna come to noise reduction, and we're gonna select noise reduction process. As you can see, it has picked up the noise. And at the bottom, I have settings that I have picked for my microphone. You can customize it, or you can use my settings. So I set the noise reduction to 80% and reduce by 13 decibels. I'm gonna select apply. And you can see that background noise has gone. I can play it through again, and this is now what we have. As you can see, completely silent. In this video, I'll be showing you how to improve your microphone quality in Adobe Audition. So after that, we're gonna press Control A on our keyboard so our track is highlighted. We're gonna come back to effects and from here, what we're going to be doing is coming to amplitude and compression and we're just gonna normalize it. I'm gonna select DB and I'm gonna set this to minus one. I'm gonna select apply and leave that as it is. Now everything is still highlighted and we're nowhere near done. All we've done is remove the background noise. So the next thing we're gonna do is head over to effects and we're gonna add some bass to our voice. So we're gonna to come to uh, filter and equalization. And what I recommend is adding on one of these three. Now you can pick any of these three because you're gonna adjust it anyway. So I'm just gonna select this 20 bands one here. From here, you can see we have presets. Now there's a bunch of different presets you can pick from. However, I do recommend picking default and then just customizing it to how you want it. So usually it's only the last four you would need to adjust and you kind of want to like loop it. So you can see it's going to go up like this. So that's what I've done very quickly. Just make it go up and back down. I'm going to select apply. That is now done. I'm going to come back to effects. I'm going to come back to um, Amplitude and Compression, and once again, I'm going to select Normalize. I'm going to select Apply. Now, once again, I'm going to make sure everything is highlighted by pressing Control A on my keyboard. I'm then going to come up to Effects. I'm going to come back to Amplitude and Compression. This time, I'm going to select Single Band Compressor. Now, from here, where it says Threshold, we're going to set this to minus 15. And for the ratio, we're going to set this to 12. The attack we're gonna to set to zero and everything else you can leave as is. I'm gonna select apply. As you can see, everything is now leveled out. Although we have leveled out the audio, it's now pretty quiet. So what we're gonna do is normalize it. So we're gonna come back to effects. We're gonna to come to amplitude and compression and we're gonna select normalize. From here, normalize to minus one decibels and select apply. Now, just like that, your audio is balanced out. So, as you can see, it's just hitting minus three, and I'll play this through from the beginning because this is now complete. 
In this video, I'll be showing you how to improve your microphone quality in Adobe Audition. And there we go. Now you can see the levels were hitting pretty high. So what we can also do is press Control A and you can see as the decibels here, we can just bring this down a little bit so then it's not too loud. And just like that, everything has changed and I'll play it through one more time. In this video, I'll be showing you how to improve your microphone quality in Adobe Audition. And just like that, it is done. That is it for this tutorial, you can see it is just a few simple steps to make your microphone sound a lot better. Now this works with high end mics and it also works with the lower end mics as well. So definitely give it a try no matter what microphone you are using. 